Hello everyone and welcome to another one of my tutorials. In this tutorial, I will teach you how to make a fire, blue fire text in Photoshop CS5. This can be done in any other version of Photoshop. This is an example of what it will look like, or something around it. Make a new one, it can be at any size. And instead of doing my original thing where I duplicate the background and color it in with the bucket tool, all you have to do is hit shift and backspace and change the color to black. And hit OK. Next, uh, open up a text and type in anything. I'm going to type in Towelly. It can be in any color that you want. So the first thing you want to do is duplicate the layer. Then go into the first layer and go into its layer styles. In there, change the fill opacity to 0%. Then make an outer glow and an inner glow. Change the color for the outer glow into something blue, like so. And in the inner glow, same thing. We'll make it a lighter blue. Make sure its size is at 18 pixels. Hit OK. Now, go to the second one and do the same thing. Take away its fill opacity and make an outer and inner glow. Change its colors to however you want. And I will, of course, make uh, put the color codes in the description of what the of my original picture that I showed you. If you want to make it look like that, and make this one size 10, and hit OK. Next, you're gonna want to right-click and hit uh, Resaturize Type and it'll make it into a layer, not no longer a text layer. So you can uh, get your smudge tool and you can change the smudge uh, brush to however you like but make sure it's at 75% uh, strength. Oops. Okay, so what you want to do now is uh, just smudge it to however you like. Uh, if you're really artistic, you'll get the hang of this. Uh, you can do whatever you like. Uh, just make it look fiery. You don't like just uh, really just hit the brush everywhere around the picture. You want to make it look like a real flame. Okay, so once you've done that, what you want to do is go to the layer. Uh, box again and hit control and left click it'll select everything over here now what you want to do is go up to the select tab and hit uh, inverse and then hit your delete button that'll get rid of the extra uh, space around the text to make it look more realistic so what you want to do again is hit control and left click the layer again and make a new layer and hit shift and backspace again and this time make the color white now once you've done that you can uh, deselect the layer and on the white overlay uh, make it overlay so it'll come out like that So this has been another tutorial from Tauli, aka Andre. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope this helped you. If you have any questions, uh, you can ask me it in my uh, private messages box on here. I'll most likely respond if you uh, private message me, Tauli on zakum.org, Z-A-K-U-M dot org. It has all uh, of my designs on there now and I'll be making a lot of tutorials on there as well that may not be available on uh, on YouTube so uh, make sure you go by there check it out 
Uh, don't forget to subscribe and like this video if it helped you. Thank you for watching.